Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. Please excuse my voice, I've been fighting a bit of a cold recently, but I did just want to tell you a little bit about what I'm doing in this spread. So this is a journal I made to document my summer memories and I'm breaking it in, working on the first few pages today. As you saw earlier, I was able to add some charms and ribbon before I got started and I love them, I think they look so cute and really add so much charm to the journal. Charm, get it? Anyways, right now I'm just planning out the page to look super colorful and pretty and I'm adding a picture of me to the first page so I can write a little bit about where I am in my life right now. I'm going to be working across quite a few pages because I have so much ephemera I've collected over time so I'm really just trying to have fun by sticking it all in my journal. So I'm sticking this cute little mouse on the bottom of the page and then I'm putting the packaging from this jasmine essential oil that I got. I started wearing it as a perfume at the beginning of the summer and I think it smells so nice and it also reminds me of my yoga studio which is where I got the essential oil. I'm actually at my yoga studio in the selfie that I put on the page and the next few pages I continue to write about it because this was really the very last day I got to go. My yoga studio was officially closing down so the next few pages are about how much my yoga studio helped me on my journey and just a little reflection about how much it has impacted my life but right now I don't think I know the direction I want to go with this spread and I think I'm actually feeling overwhelmed with how much stuff I have and also trying to make sure that the first page looks perfect even though I know that's not always how it ends up being but um, I also just work all over the place flipping between pages Pages to see if what I have might look good somewhere else but there's never any method to the madness it's sometimes it's just madness but I do know that I want to leave a little bit of space so I can write even if it's just a few sentences my intention for this book was to be a lot more visual I mostly wanted it just as a place for me to keep all of my photos from the summer in a physical form um, I don't really like relying on things only being digital but of course I want to have fun with creating a story with them as well and that's one of the reasons why I love junk journaling so much it's so I can turn my memories into a story on a page for me to look back on whenever I want so a few other things I document in this video is a date that me and my boyfriend went on and also some photos from a journal collection that I worked really hard on and released in my Etsy shop this summer um, and I'm also not really documenting chronologically I'm just acting intuitively and in where things seem fit for me you'll also also notice that not everything I cut out or have with me will get put on the page but it will eventually get used probably in another junk journal with me and also I did end up cutting out a lot of footage and eventually stopped filming because I was just taking so long and was so indecisive so I'm sparing you guys the boring stuff and you will just get to see the finished pages towards the end so with that being said, I'm going to let you guys enjoy the rest of this video so you don't have to hear my sick voice, but please leave a thumbs up if you like this video and stay tuned for more journaling videos. Bye!